Okay, now let's just talk about the story sent to me by a team member, right? And our credible source is the sun because we don't want you to think that we're making this story up. And the date is the 24th of June 2022. Now, what is the sun telling us? Planet seven planets will align in the night sky tonight in rare space event and best time to watch. Stargazers are in for a celestial treat tonight as not one, not two, but seven planets line up in pre-dawn sky. Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Neptune, and Uranus line up in the early hours of Friday morning and will do so again on Saturday and Sunday. What is the June 24th conjunction? The rare planetary alignment will feature a total of seven planets, the first conjunction of this scale in 18 years. The best time to watch is about half an hour before sunrise, before June 24th and 27th. Five of the solar systems, Stalwarth, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, and Saturn will be visible to the naked eye on Friday, right? Now, before you all going out manifesting and celebrating, understand that these planetary bodies are angelic beings and they were put there in the sky as punishment, right? And they are reserved for judgment. So these fallen angels are not just put in um, by Antarctica or under the Euphrates rivers. They're not only tied up there, but they're also placed in the skies as well. Right? Now, you need to go and read the book of Enoch about the luminaries. Right? There's plenty of information there. And understand that each of these planets, they are an ancient god or goddesses. And you can find the information in mythology that they would want you to believe it never happened. Just sweep it under the carpet. They were ancient gods and goddesses and they were wreaking havoc on this earth. Right, So when you see them line up and they continue to move around, they are getting ready to be released here on earth. right? And if you go and research mythology, each one of these planets, right, go research the names of the gods they represent. You will understand what they were up to and have a good idea what they will be doing when they are released understand now is not the time to be celebrating now is the time to be seeking the face of the most high because they are intelligent being and they understand their time is short they understand the judgment that they will face right so when they come back they won't be your friend they won't be your god and your goddess is showing you mercy seek the face of the most high while he can be found let us pray and say glory be to the most high.